So tell us about that, the block there. It's all coming down the season there to get that block. What happened? Uh, you know, it's just something we kind of, you know, drew in the dirt on the sideline. So I put the bug in Coach Romano's ear earlier this year, you know, because in 2011, I had three blocks, Cody Wickman had four. And as a unit, we had a, we had 11 blocks that season. So, you know, we just <clears throat> kind of put the bug in his ear and drew it up in the dirt. And the season's on the line, so we've got to go. How, how, can, can you describe the play? What, what exactly happened? You, you reach out and, and get it? You uh, yeah, I lined up between, uh, behind Cody and Austin. And they were on top of the right guard. They just blew him up. And I was right behind him as a jumper. I just jumped straight up in the air, got my arm up, got a piece of it. You think that's the highest you've ever jumped? <laughs> Honestly, I didn't even feel like I jumped. I didn't feel like I got a good jump. But I guess I got good enough extension. I got long arms, so <laughs> whatever I did, I got it. <laughs> and then what, what were the emotions like? Oh, man, it was just exhilaration, you know, excitement. But at the same time, <clears throat> we still, we haven't, we didn't, that didn't win the game for us, you know. We still got to go. Can you talk about the offense all together, you know, kind of struggling early on and picked it up at the end and then, you know, off, off and it again? Uh, you know, they, they get a lot of credit to San Diego. They got, they got some players on their team. You know, their, their record doesn't really speak for how good they are. Uh, you know, they, they, they threw a couple of things at us that we didn't see on film, but, you know, we're just trying to spread them out as much as we could. And, a lot of, and then a lot of the things, some things were self-inflicted too, but, I think overall, you know, that, that was a good team. Gotta give them credit. And just your, <laughs> you know, you couldn't you couldn't write this in a script any better. You know, we, we've won what's this three games now down to the wire, and I just that room, that locker room over there is full of competitors. And when when it's when it's crunch time, you know, we're gonna compete, and that's exactly what we do. Yeah, Marcel, you, I don't think you had a catch today, but maybe came up with the biggest play not only of the game but of the season now. Just how, how does it feel to contribute in that way? You know, that's one thing one of the coaches was telling me after the game because I didn't I didn't play much this game. You know, it was a, it was a game plan deal. The defense that they run, you know, it's, attaching a tight end isn't the best thing to do against this type of defense. But uh, you know, they called my number, had me go out there for the uh, field goal block, and I just you know I stayed in the game the whole time, kept my head in the game. You know, I never got discouraged. I understood why I wasn't playing much this game. It wasn't because of anything I had done, but kept my head in the game. And once my number was called, I just went out there and did what I could to help the team win.